Okay guys, um, this next video I'm making is how to submit the assignments that you see coming from a place called Excelsior College. Okay, so uh, as a bit of a background, um, what you've noticed is you don't actually have a textbook for this class. And the reason why is because I got the majority of the information for this class from uh, Excelsior College. I'm not exactly sure where Excelsior is, but it's a college here in the United States. And they offer uh, what they call OER materials. And OER simply means uh, open educational resources. Uh, basically, what they want to do is offer you edu educational content for free. And so I've used Excelsior College for a lot of different assignments, uh, quizzes, information about the writing process. Um, and, and a lot of the assignments that they've made, I've uploaded in the Canvas. And there's a special way that you actually have to submit these assignments in order for me to actually grade them. So I'm going to go ahead and give you an example of how this is going to look. So looking right here at one of these assignments, for example, run on sentences quiz. Let me click on this real quick. And so what you see is it's a... Um, almost kind of looks like a PowerPoint or a Google Slides presentation. And you, what you'll see is a little icon with some owls or down here, Excelsior College. And th that should be a pretty decent idea to tell you that this is coming from outside of Canvas. And so what this, is, what this particular assignment is, is an activity on run-on sentences, whatever. And so let's say you wanted to do this quiz and receive a score. And so what you'll see down here are these little arrows that kind of lead you through this, this exercise. And there's all this information and then a bit of a quiz right here. And you just kind of go right on through, test yourself, take this quiz or answer this question all the way through. And at the very, very end, you're going to receive a score. OK, and that's going to be consistent for uh, all of these assignments that are coming from Excelsior College. I'm pretty sure that once you get going, you're going to notice this fairly frequently in the first couple of weeks. Um, and once you've done this a couple of times uh, submitting it, uh, I don't think you're going to have any real troubles. So ultimately, um, you want to focus on this screen right here that gives you a score. In this case, my score says 0 out of 11 because it didn't actually take it. But let's assume that you have and you've received a score of like 10 out of 11. Right now, what you need to do is actually submit um, a screenshot or a PDF file of this screen the slide because even though you've taken the quiz even though you've gotten a score it doesn't actually connect to your gradebook so you actually need to submit this like you would submit a document and so if you will go up here you will actually see that blue submit assignment button and if you click on it it will allow you to do a file upload or connect to your google docs um, but what you want to obviously submit is this screen that you have right in front of you that tells me what your score is. And so how you can do this is a number of different ways. Uh, the first one is just to print it like it is a like a PDF file. So if I were to go up here and go to print, I want to change my destination to a PDF. I can save it and you can kind of see right here that this is kind of the what you get out of it is this kind of thing, right? And you can submit this on Canvas like much like a like a like a like a document. So you'd save this as a PDF file and then you would upload it as a document. Okay? Uh, if I wanted to do a screenshot of it, what I can do is just simply take a screenshot, right, and go to a blank document and then right click and paste. And now I actually have a screenshot of that particular page, which again shows me your score and what you got out of it. And then what you would do is you would upload that document onto Canvas. OK, so those are the two ways that I would suggest to you. I've known students who uh, have actually taken like a photo of it and uploaded like a JPEG file. Um, you could try that if you want, but that's kind of harder for me to demonstrate for you. But if you're on your computer, the two easiest ways of doing this is to either save this particular page as a PDF file 
or to take a screenshot of this page, paste it onto a document and upload the document. And you're going to do this for every one of these Excelsior College assignments. And there's going to be a lot of them, especially in the first couple of weeks. Um, again, once you get, get handy with it, it'll become second nature. I don't think you guys will have any major problems. But please understand that just because you get here and you get a score does not mean it actually goes in the canvas. You have to submit it. And then what I do is I go through your submissions and manually enter your scores from there. Uh, so if you guys have any questions on this, please let me know. Um, I think it's fairly user friendly once you get the hang of it. I just want you to understand that you actually need to submit this image of your score as you would submit any other kind of document. And that's how you're going to do that for these kinds of assignments. So let me know if you guys have any questions.